Edge of the Web, on the road at SMX. We had a great time at SMX West this year, and we're able to sit down and talk to some fantastic thought leaders in the digital marketing space. Huge thanks to Third Door Media, who opened the door for Edge of the Web to be there at the conference. Uh, we sat down and talked with Morty Oberstein, CMO of Rank Ranger and a host of the In Search SEO podcast, my brother from another mother. Uh, give it a watch and listen. We had a great time. Your weekly digital marketing trends with industry trend setting guests. You're listening and watching Edge of the Web. Winners of Best Podcast from the Content Marketing Institute for 2017. Here and see more at edgeofthewebradio.com. Now, here's your host, Aaron Sparks. We're here at SMX West 2020, interviewing a number of key thought leaders in digital marketing. And lo and behold, we come across a, 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 a comrade in arms here. We got Morty Oberstein of the In Search SEO podcast. And we're going to have a little bit of an inception here because we're actually going to have a show about doing shows. Ooh. <laughs> it's like watching TV, but they're watching TV on TV. Morty is with Rank Ranger, a fantastic product of uh, SEO optimization and rank tracking. So, Morty, tell us a little bit about Rank Ranger first and uh, the tool set that you have in there. Yeah, so we're one of the you know rank tracking tools, but we're not really just rank tracking. Yeah. I hate that label because oh, you just do rank. We track it's a lot in your of name, man. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's okay. but there's a ranger part too. There is, right. there is. Absolutely. And that means, no, um, we do a lot of custom stuff. So you create custom graphs, custom dashboards for yourself. Um, right. We have a really cool thing that no one else has, actually. Mm. We track rank above the fold. So we tell you if you are or not above the fold for various screen sizes. Yep. Um, but, you know, com uh, competitor analysis, surf feature analysis, right. uh, obviously rank tracking, um, integrations, all sorts of digital um, yaks and your... Um, Obviously, your Google Analytics search console, but tons and tons of integrations you can bring it in. And then yep. we let you do like custom comparisons. So you can oh, check wow. like um, my Google ads versus my Bing ads versus my email marketing campaigns, which one is my, you know, has greater return on investment, that sort okay. of thing. So, huh. Uh, as I remember, I've used the tool before, and you had a really good, uh, you were an early adopter of of uh, geotargeting rank. Yeah. And yep. you still have a really, yeah, really a lot robust. Of we have a new one we didn't officially announce yet. It's called the Geo Insights Report. Huh. So it's basically, if let's say you're tracking, um, let's say you're doing um, you know, SEO for uh, Domino's Pizza. Right. right. So you have locations all across the globe or all across America, let's say. Right. So you will let, we'll show you on, on a map how you rank for each location. And then we'll, you can even set it up and see where you win feature snippets based upon which location. Oh, wow. Or other SERP features as well. But, Feature snippets being the most important one. That's a huge amount of data pulling uh, yeah. from, from from those local, re those regional. So you have to de designate each and every one of those. Yeah, you got to set that up. But once you set it up, that's all there. That's sweet. Yep. So sweet. kudos to Rank, Rank Ranger. You've been doing a bang up job. And you're one of the top tools in the industry for that. Um, you, you you turned around and and just recently you, you rolled out a podcast, the yeah. In Search SEO podcast. 60 episodes, something like that. Yeah. Yep. Congrats. Thank you. Tell me, tell me why in the world, why the hell would you want to do that? Because I like to talk. <laughs> and it was a great way to bring my love of schmoozing yeah. into my professional life. I can appreciate but that. But also, and not to take shots at other podcasts, definitely not Edge of the Web. Well, thank you. You were an inspiration, Gratu rather. Gratuitous plug. Thank you so much. Yeah, absolutely. Um, <laughs> I hate podcasts that sound like this. And today we're going to be talking about your backlink profile and all the ways you can build your backlink like profile. Balls from, uh... I would rather jump off a building and stab myself on the way down five times. <laughs> So we wanted to put a little bit of fun into it because I just thought it'd be fun to Absolutely. do that. And it worked out really well in yep. the end. Yeah. So how, uh, you're certainly getting a good following there. And it yeah. also colors the personality of Rank Ranger, right? And we, we sort of feel like you can do solid marketing, solid reporting, solid data, mm -hmm. but you don't have to be dry. Like right. you have personality. Well, I mean, us as an SEO analytic uh, professionals, Tend to be a little bit introverted sometimes. You really can't spice up SEO that much, can you? Yeah, sure you can. Absolutely. First off, you, you have the ultimate enemy, right? <laughs> you have Google. And then you have the. They're listening right now. I know. That. And that's fine. And then you have like the idiot par excellence, which is Bing, right? <laughs> I mean, I'm obviously like God. being, you know, a little bit like hyperbolic about this, but there, there's a lot of, there is a lot of personality and there's a yeah. lot of interdynamics and you can have a good time with it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, so we were talking right before we got on stage here about something that you're doing right now that's really, really interesting regarding connecting organizations that need assistance with with analyzing their data and, and marketing initiatives. So yeah. that was that's what really was the impetus of the entire thing. Unpack that for me. What's going on? Okay, so we're um 
Well, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you the backstory behind it. And it didn't roll out yet, mm -hmm. but it's coming. So we had a bunch of clients approach us saying, we know we really love your data, mm -hmm. but we also would love some deliverables. And that's just not our thing. We are an not, S yeah, yeah. We, we're a data platform right. and, and that's what we do. Um, but at the same time, we really wanted to help our clients because that's also what we do. Right. So how do we fix this? So what we decided was we're calling it Enterprise 360. Mm -hmm. And it's basically, we will walk you through the entire process. So if you're doing SEO at scale, let's say, and let's say you're, um, you're an in-house team, you're underfunded and you're understaffed. Sound familiar? Yeah. Yes, probably. <laughs> All right. <laughs> right. And you need help. So we will, we will vet agencies for you. We'll, we have partner agencies that we can hook you up with. All right. We'll figure, we'll walk you through and figure out, okay, what do you need? What kind of agency works best for you? Uh -huh. And then we'll monitor along the way to make sure you're actually getting what you need from them. Huh. And that's working for you. And if not, let's switch you around. Let's move you around. Or let's say, you know what? You don't need that like, level of support. Right. You know, you have a project you're working on or you need to do X, Y, and Z. And it's like, again, too small of a budget, not enough time, not enough manpower, whatever it is. Right. So we're having, uh, we have an expert hub where we will connect you with people like Alayda Solis, Greg Gifford, um, wow. Stefan Spencer, um, Eli Schwartz. There you go. Plug for my, he has to meet my cousin, by the way. So a little plug for Eli over there. Uh, <laughs> family discount for Eli. Um, <laughs> but no favoritism in the hub. Absolutely not. No, because it's you setting it up. So you can pick who you want. Uh, we'll, again, we'll, we'll consult with you. Uh, what are you looking to do? What might be right for you? What do you want to go with this? And then we'll make the connection for you and, and go. Huh. So uh, again, point to, which is a fantastic thing, but, but, but non-favoritism, you're also not denominational of just using your platform. No, I mean, obviously the expert has complete access to Rank Ranger. Right. Uh, and training on Rank Ranger. Right. And the, the client, our Rank Ranger clients, you're buying a data package. It comes all, it's all one big bundle. Cool. So yeah, I mean, if your client, if the client's getting Rank Ranger tools and they're getting Rank Ranger reports, then fine. But if, right, there's a better tool that does something differently that you need, whatever it is, and, the, and the, you're the expert working with one of our clients. Yep. We don't want you to to use what we have if you have something that works differently, that works a little bit, you know, more nuanced for this particular client. Or perhaps they maybe have a lot of investment into the 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 editing and the and the categorization that they've done on a particular tool. Yes, so whatever it is, right. we want the we want our clients to be happy, and we want our clients to get the most that they can possibly get of their SO efforts. Mm -hmm. and we want to help you do that. So whatever works best works best. Whatever it, it, we want you to win on the SERP. So that's 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 laudable, and that's 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 actually a very, I, I almost want to say noble pursuit because you don't see a lot of SaaS companies roll that out into and extend those type of services. So what what was this impetus? Why did you want to outside of of doing right for the clients? This is a whole another e extension outside of your your wheelhouse. Yeah. Um, well, one of the you know. Over the years, we've developed a lot of nice relationships with a lot of different people in SEO. Sure. So it was really just a natural segue. Like, hey, you know, we know all these different experts. We know all these different agencies. Why don't we just put that to good use? Kind of made sense. Yeah, it's just, you know, it's the natural evolution of Rank Ranger, so That's to speak. Cool. That's cool. Yeah, some, you know, those are the best ways. You know, it just kind of flows. All right. So anybody who's listening to this or watching this can certainly reach out to you, you yes. at, at Rank Ranger. But um, what what thoughts would you give to that that beleaguered uh, marketing group inside of that enterprise that that is they're wearing so many bloody hats what kind of guidance would you give them just to just to to, to look out and, and and find some hope there i mean look everybody's in the same boat as you right right everybody i don't care how much money you have and how much how big of a team you have everybody has to prioritize right and the truth and the, the truth is at the end of the day if you prioritize the right way look i know i can only speak for myself right i have a million things i need to do there's a million things i want to put out there and this is not going to happen right but if you prioritize what you need to do what needs to get done does get done and you sort of move on by yeah could you move by a little bit better more efficiently grow a little bit faster sure mm -hmm. but you'll it's you know slow and steady wins the race it's okay so hang in there everyone's, hey, everyone's in the same boat and on top of it just get it done right Oh, look, get her done. Get her done. <laughs> I, had to, I had to go there. Absolutely. Marty, thanks so much, Annie. Good luck in the podcast. You're going to yeah. keep on doing it, right? Oh, I love it. We're, we're full on. I have, we're stacked up with interviews for the next like three months already. Fantastic. Yep. It was kinda, it's kind of uh, infectious, isn't it? I love it. All right. All right. Good, good, good. Well, good luck to you. And uh, we'll certainly uh, be champion of Rank Ranger. You've been a tool. Uh, no, you haven't been a tool. I, I am a tool. <laughs> That's Rank okay. Rank Ranger has been around, has, has passed muster. You've been around. 
15, 10 or 15 uh, years? 10 years, 10, 10 years. years. You know, look for us on Search Engine Land every time someone mentions a surf feature data point. There you go. It's usually Rank Ranger. Fantastic. Yep. All right, man. Thanks so much. I yeah. appreciate the time. Thank you, man. Absolutely. Appreciate it. All right.